Greetings everyone. I hope this message finds you well. Have you ever wondered about the health of your heart? Are you confident that your heart and arteries are completely clear and free from any potential risk of heart attack or stroke? It's difficult to know for sure if our heart is healthy until it's too late. However, in this video, I will share with you some valuable insights about the warning signs and symptoms that can predict heart problems and help you take preventive measures. So, I invite you to watch this video until the very end and learn how to protect your heart and improve your overall health. Heart disease is not a problem just for old people anymore. Heart disease is no longer just a problem for older people, it's a reality for everyone. In fact, according to the World Health Organization, over 1 billion people worldwide suffer from various forms of cardiovascular disease CVD. This number represents almost 30% of all deaths worldwide. And why is CVD becoming more prevalent? According to the American Heart Association, it's because we lead increasingly sedentary lifestyles coupled with poor diets high in processed foods and sugar-sweetened beverages. The result? More cases of obesity, type 2 diabetes, high blood pressure, hypertension, high cholesterol levels. In this video, I will be discussing the warning signs and symptoms of an impending heart attack. If you are interested in learning more about how to protect yourself and your loved ones from the devastating effects of heart disease, then I encourage you to join me. You won't want to miss this opportunity to learn more about how to recognize the warning signs and symptoms of an impending heart attack. So, join me and discover the critical warning signs that can help save a life. While there are many ways to prevent heart attacks, the first step is understanding their nature. A heart attack occurs when one of the coronary arteries becomes blocked, leading to an acute myocardial infarction. As we age, our arteries go through a natural process called atherosclerosis, which involves the buildup of fat inside the vessels, including the coronary arteries. Over time, this accumulation of fat can clog the artery until it reaches a critical point, such as 70% blockage. At this stage, the wall protecting the vessel becomes unstable, leading to a rupture that triggers a cascade of events, including platelet aggregation and thrombus formation, that ultimately results in the occlusion of the affected vessel and an acute myocardial infarction. By understanding how these events unfold over time and what you can do to mitigate your risk factors and prevent this potentially life-threatening event, you can take steps to make sure you're always ready for whatever life throws your way. Are you aware that the accumulation of fat inside your vessels can lead to the blockage of your coronary arteries and cause a heart attack? It's not just about having a blockage, but the time it takes for them to open up can be catastrophic for your heart muscle. And there are certain factors that accelerate this process such as leading a sedentary lifestyle, being overweight, experiencing stress, and having high blood pressure, diabetes, or dyslipidemia. High LDL cholesterol and low HDL cholesterol are some of the classic risk factors that contribute to this process over time. So it's important to be proactive in managing these risk factors so you can reduce your chances of developing heart disease and improve your overall health. If you want to avoid a heart attack, it's important to know what signs to look for and how to react when they do appear. The truth is that most heart attacks are preceded by no symptoms at all. If you smoke, have high blood pressure or diabetes, and suddenly experience chest pain, you could be having a heart attack. In fact, even if you've never felt chest pain before, it's still important to see a good cardiologist and get routine exams before a heart attack occurs. Even if you've been diagnosed with high blood pressure or diabetes, the first step is always prevention. That's why it's critical to prioritize your health and start taking action now before it's too late. Remember, prevention is always better than cure. Have you ever wondered if there's a clogged artery in your heart that you're unaware of? While it's true that the heart doesn't always give prior warning signs of a heart attack, there are still some physical symptoms that you should be aware of. If you notice anything unusual, it's essential to seek medical attention right away. By doing so, you can prevent a heart attack or even save your life. In fact, I've created a video discussing the tests that we use to identify clogged arteries in the heart. If you experience chest pain, it's crucial to seek medical attention immediately. This type of pain is also known as angina, and it can be caused by a number of different issues, including clogged arteries in your heart. Chest pain is typically accompanied by sweating, nausea, and sometimes vomiting. 
It can also radiate to your left arm, chin, and epigastrium regions. If you experience this type of pain, it's crucial to seek medical attention immediately or at least consult with a cardiologist as soon as possible. Ignoring this pain could be a warning sign that something more serious is happening in your body and could potentially lead to an acute myocardial infarction, heart attack. Remember, chest pain is the first sign and symptom to watch out for and take seriously. However, chest pain may not always be present, especially in diabetic patients, the elderly, and women. In such cases, atypical symptoms may occur days or weeks before the heart attack. You may start feeling unusually fatigued, like being out of breath after walking only a short distance, even though you had no such problem before. It may feel like you are extremely tired with tasks that you could easily perform earlier. These symptoms should not be ignored and must prompt you to seek medical attention. They could be indicative of a clogged artery in your heart and a potential heart attack. A doctor can examine your blood pressure and check other vital signs, heart rate, breathing rate, to determine if your heart is beating at an abnormally fast or slow rate. Your doctor will also listen to your heart with a stethoscope to determine whether it sounds normal or abnormal. He or she may order tests such as an electrocardiogram, EKG, which records electrical activity within the heart, an X-ray, and or an angiogram, a procedure where dye is injected into an artery. If these tests reveal any blockage in your arteries causing angina pectoris symptoms, then your doctor may prescribe medication to help relieve these symptoms. It's important to be smart and aware of the warning signs of a potential heart attack, especially since they don't always manifest as chest pain. Some individuals, such as diabetics, the elderly, and women, may experience atypical symptoms such as fatigue or shortness of breath that occur days or weeks before the actual event. This can be a sign that there may be a clogged artery in your heart, which could lead to an acute myocardial infarction if left untreated. So, don't ignore any changes in your energy levels or breathing patterns, and seek out a cardiologist if you're feeling more tired than usual with less effort, or experiencing shortness of breath even at rest. Being proactive and getting ahead of these warning signs can be life-saving. A study published in the New England Journal of Medicine found that between 20% and 30% of people who experience symptoms like those described above will have some type of heart disease within 10 years, and that only about half of these individuals will actually go on to die from it. So it's important for all people who are experiencing these symptoms, not just those who have been diagnosed with heart disease, to see a doctor immediately for further testing and treatment options. Dizziness, palpitations, are they just signs of nerves? Or could they be a sign that something more serious is going on in your body? In some cases, a blocked artery in the heart can cause cardiac arrhythmias, which are irregularities in the heart's rhythm. Normally, the heart beats rhythmically, but when an artery is clogged, it can lead to a heart attack in the future and cause arrhythmia. How does arrhythmia affect the body? It often manifests itself as palpitations, which can be a warning sign that you should see a cardiologist. Don't ignore these symptoms, as they could be a signal that something more serious is happening in your body. If you're experiencing palpitations, it's time to get to the bottom of it. Palpitations are the sensation of feeling your heart beating, which is normally not noticeable. However, when you start feeling your heart beating, it could be a palpitation. Palpitations may or may not indicate cardiac arrhythmia, but they should always be investigated. Sometimes, arrhythmias occur in a sequence and the heart shakes instead of beating effectively. This can lead to a decrease in blood flow to the brain, causing episodes of dizziness or even fainting. In more severe cases, fainting can occur. Therefore, if you experience palpitations or any other symptoms related to the heart, it is essential to seek medical attention. A heart attack is essentially when your heart muscle is damaged. It can happen suddenly or over time. When it happens to you, the most common symptoms include chest pain, shortness of breath, dizziness, fainting, or even loss of consciousness. It can be scary to think that something like this could happen to you, and it's important not to wait until it does. Don't hesitate to reach out to a qualified professional who can evaluate your condition and offer the necessary treatment. I hope this information was helpful. If so, please don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. This way you can help us spread more awareness and knowledge about heart attacks around the world.
Remember, my goal is to save lives by educating people about this serious condition so they can take action before it's too late. Take care of yourself today and every day.